Okay guys, I wanted to show you how to cut an outlet in an island, an outlet into an island. So here's our island that is out here in the middle of the kitchen, well, not in the middle, but yeah, out in the kitchen. With the sink in it, we did the disposal dishwasher box with the switch in it already in the last video. So now it needs an outlet on the end of it. You can't put it underneath the this overhang right here. It cannot go under an overhang. So it has to go on the end. And if your island has a big overhang on this end, then you would need to, oh, sorry about that. You would need to come over to this other end. There again, not under the overhang, not allowed. So we chose this end as you come in and that's where they drew it on the plans anyway. And what we like to do is we, use, we like to use this uh, oscillator uh, Milwaukee tool. Let's see, it is the, see if the camera will focus in here. Come on, come on. There we go. There it is, multi-tool. And it's got these uh, blades on them you can get for wood or metal or hardwood, fine wood. It's got an uh, adjustment on it on how much it ice oscillates. I'd like to turn it down just a little bit. So I've already got started on this. I've already gotten down, I have already gone down two sides. So here I go, I'll go finish cutting that out. And how I knew how big to go, sorry guys, forgot to tell you, is this box. This is a cabinet box. They sell these at all the hardware stores, uh, Home Depot, and this is the one I like to use because when there's drawers in the island, they're small enough to put into. Now, I probably could use the bigger one here, but I still don't want to because the dishwasher goes there and I don't want it sticking out real far. These work out really good for us. Now, remember, you don't want the GFI in this box. They don't fit. You want to come off of the last one on the counter, like we talked and did in our other video. Um, you will want it to come off of that on the rough end, down and through the floor, and back up and into the cabinet like we did here. And there's the wire coming through the floor. And then it'll run right over to where I'm going to put this box that's cutting out there. Okay, guys, let's finish cutting this out. How we put the outlet in the cabinet. Here we go. Okay, so then you get your box, make sure it fits in there good and snug, and, and if it needs a little adjusting, then now's the time to do that. That's a little, it is a little hard there, but I think I like that fit. I think I like that fit the best. Okay, so then what you do is, I can see the wire in there. There's our wire coming through the floor. The one with flex goes over to the one under the sink. It has to be protected if it goes into the cabinet bay. But this one won't need flex on it because it'll be back behind in this dead space. 
so we won't need flex on this one. It can come right out to the outlet. And then you see right there is where the dishwasher will come in and stop at that wood grain color there where the flex comes out. So let's go get our wire. Okay, so we'll come in here, grab our wire. And let's push it up through the hole that we just made. No, I don't want to stay out there. Okay, pushed it through the hole on the inside. We'll come on out. Now see, this is where the dishwasher will go. Um, and that'll be plenty behind the dishwasher. The dishwasher will not go even close to that wire. It'll stop. It won't go back that far. And then the plumbers will drill the hole through the corner right there to bring it in to this side where we did the other day and he'll plug it into that GFI over there. So that's how the dishwasher will go and just plug on in. So. Here we go, so I pull this wire. I leave a little bit of slack in there. I like to because in case somebody else has to work on it again another day, they'll, they'll have some wire to, to play with. And we turned the power on yesterday, so I wanna make sure that the power is still off with this uh, power tester, which it is. So I can go ahead and cut the wire. Okay. And take our blue box. Gosh dang it. Where did that, oh right there, okay. And then what you wanna do is there's a little uh, notch right here on the blue box. You want to knock that out with like a screwdriver or so. Um, I'm going to knock that out. I don't know how I hold the camera and do that, but let's try it. 